Hundreds of teenagers are stepping up to help the city of Waterbury dig out after that big storm. Mayor Neil O'Leary giving the kids some cash, putting them to work. News 8's Jamie Miro has the story. Yes, yes, make that money! All you have to do is ask, because you never know how many hundreds of people will line up to dig you out. Why don't you, you know, get these kids uh, off the, behind the TVs and off the computers and, and put them to work. Which is exactly what Waterbury did, posted an advertisement in the local paper. As long as you want to keep working, we'll keep going. Promising minimum wage to anyone willing to put in some long hours of backbreaking work. You all see this? All to clear feet of snow from city schools. Well, I'm happy I even got on the bus. You see how many people out here? Jose Cabrera was one of the first on the bus. I was tired the last three days shoveling, so it's just an added bonus. The army of volunteers, mostly youth, were divided up to attack different parts of the city. Jose's short trip from City Hall was to Walsh Elementary School. Yeah, this is too much. They don't know what they're gonna do with all this. Progress was made quickly. Each scoop one step closer to getting six-year-old Omar Singh back to class. Are you missing being in school? <laughs> <laughs> All you have to do is ask, and if you're curious if 17-year-old Jose will be back tomorrow, well, ask him. Well, we're going to do a good job. We're going to get it done. When you have this much snow, and clearly Waterbury's got a lot of snow, one day of work isn't going to do it. So everyone that's working today is invited to come back tomorrow. Pick up time at City Hall, 9 a.m. Reporting from Waterbury, I'm Jamie Miro. You say.